Welcome back to the channel guys. Today we're going to show off our 34 million dollar horse ranch. That's what we've sunk into this place from start to finish. It's fully furnished equipment, buildings, landscaping, all the property. 34 million dollars. And the map is Doll Ranch and this is one of my favorite maps. I I'll have spent a lot of time on this map on PlayStation 4 back before I got my PC and uh, you know I spent many hours many hours right here on Doll Ranch this is the main gate Elk Mountain Ranch decor for the front gate now when this video is over I'll do a I'll do a flyover and then I'll also do a flyover of what it normally looks like and uh, we can compare so the first shed that we come to is the Elk Mountain XL shop it's huge I mean it's plenty of storage office some outdoor chairs I mean it's I mean it's nice it's real nice super nice back in here into the workshop area you got your workshop trigger you got your lift you got uh, a switch right here on the wall for your ceiling fans and it has some big ass fans and that's actually the brand of it's actually what they're called big ass fans and first tractor we got is the 7310 We got the 84X, 8400X, the 9630, and then the big boy, the 9620. And these are the big, the big workhorses on the farm here. These two right here. These ones pull the plows, and the, also pull the cedars that we'll we'll get to in just a second. But this shop, this shop's super nice. It's a big, plenty of room. You got all that storage area upstairs. I mean it's it's big it's big it's nice it's it's one of my favorite sheds I, I almost I build with it almost every every time I build got a little bit of a jump right there got the got the King Ranch looking furniture inside here it's I mean it's nice the old vintage coke fridge shut that door we're gonna jump on a gator we're gonna take a tour so we come around the back side of this first shed here come around back in here we got the massive silo set up back here we've got the uh, liquid fertilizer tank the herbicide tank and we've got two refillable so I think those are ones for seed and ones for lime. So we've got plenty of silo space right here. Plenty. I think this thing holds, it's got like a 3 million liter capacity. It's super nice. It's got the, the grain dryer on it, built on as well. come back around here I haven't had a chance to really play this farm yet I just built it and figured I'd share it with you guys I love the building aspect of this game uh, with all the mods you can just I mean you can build damn near whatever you want I jump off here and this shed this is our shed that holds our our grain trucks We've got one Pete, two Kenworths, all boasting the, the Wilson trailers. That's plenty of, that's plenty of uh, 
cart to get the crop took to the damn sail point here. It's a it's a nice fleet of trucks right there. I I really I, those are my those are my my two favorite trucks on this whole game. That's I I just I like those those trucks. They're they're something else. Moving on. All this at one time. This was all. This was all field. Every bit of this. And I worked on the landscaping and painted it up. And all right, we're going. Ooh, I got me a little lag spike right there. We're gonna go back here and check out these sheds back here. And this is one of our big cedars right here. We got one of these with the the with the grain carts the the seed drill the john deere made by custom modding and uh well, the thing's nice it's nice don't really have a whole lot of room inside none of the buildings none of the buildings that we have the doors tall enough for them so we've had to park it outside this was this is also our bale shed too so we have this out here. This is our two mowers, two John Deere mowers. We've also got our two 60, uh, 643s out here. One with the bucket, one with the bell spike. And that's our fleet for for hay straw baling that's all that swing around right over here and go check out the what's inside this shed this shed's where we keep our balers wind rowers our bale trailers tedders everything like that plenty of equipment we got a lot of got a lot of work here a lot of acreage you know this I'm not 100% sure on how, how many acres there is here but there's quite a bit for one single farm pulling over here we've got a refillable diesel tank we have another one also on the other side over there so there's one for each building back here Inside this first bay, we've got our DB120, our Brent grain cart, and our Demco grain cart. Help get that, get the crop out to the, to the trucks. And here we got some money. We got the John Deere self-propelled spreader, as well as sprayer. And then we've got four big dog x9 john deere harvesters and these things are eight hundred thousand dollars a piece i mean this place we've 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 sunk some real money into this place and we've got the the john deere 9900 forage harvester so we've got we've got pr plenty of uh plenty of machines that do all this work Let's, massive horse ranch here we'll move along we'll go check out the animal pens we got the two two crew trucks right here anything that they need they'll haul it out to the field whatever whatever we got to do they they got plenty of trucks and equipment to get her done so moving on along Come back out around the front of the first shop here and come back out to the main drive. We're gonna hang a right.
go across this old bridge. I don't really understand this bridge right here. Looks like there'd be some kind of water here, but I don't know. I don't know. I didn't make the map. I just just play on it. So I think it took me roughly six or seven hours of, of straight hard hard at it, hard building to put this place together. Uh, I, I'm really happy with the way this place turned out. I don't know what's up with that lag tonight. So coming in here, we come to our one of our first horse areas. Got the maintenance shed right here. We've got a feed silo and we have an, a bail storage building back here. We've got the Ford F650 hooked to this super nice, it's like a camper, camper horse trailer. And uh, we go out and do any kind of events or anything like that. You know, that's what we'll take. We got the uh, little John Deere the bucket on it for clean mucking the stalls or feed or anything like that we got the two Dodge 3500s two live two horse trailers hooked ready to go we got one horse barn right here I think these things hold 15 horses a piece a little storage right here I, it's a fairly nice mod I, I really this is actually pretty nice got the outdoor lights little gate come in it's nice this is a nice barn this is a really nice barn it's like some kind of 3d picture there. that's nice yeah this is a pretty nice building here come on out here you got storage little indoor riding arena possibly okay yeah this is nice then over here on the other side we come out this gate that's just a little smaller version of this building it's just a little smaller I think it's missing the indoor riding arena it's just stalls yeah that's exactly what it is that's the big difference between the two got the outdoor riding arena right here got a little lookout tower right there that things AC got air conditioning in it so you know while you're watching uh, the horses horse events you know you can climb up there chill out have a drink I, I really I'm really happy with the way this place turned out so so nice I don't know why I'm getting such I'm getting a little bit of lag here yeah I spent a lot of time on this place oh look at there look at there big dummy Gonna we'll slide around back here. We got a silage pit back here in the back. Oh, it's cleared up. Must have been that shed. We got the cat dozer to compact with. Got the case front end loader. Nothing special here, just a old silage pit. carry on with this road take this road around and this takes you back to the original <coughs> excuse me back to the original part of the farm and uh, we've remodeled and redecorated it back here as well 
Got the old red barn back here. Got a food, uh, a grain silo back here for feed and straw and hay. Plenty of pasture back there. Yeah. We'll pull around through here. You got access to the to field seven out here. Right outside that right around that corner outside that gate. Super nice horse barn. Just I love the detail. All the wood. It's nice. It's real nice. All right, let's jump in the gator. Let's jump around, go check out the house and the, the helipad. Yeah, I said helipad. This $34 million horse ranch boasts a helipad. We did, we, we held no punches here. We, let's just cut right across to the grass back here. We got the pool. Playground. A little outdoor grill area. By the pool, nice. Get some hammocks. Yeah. Inside the garage, we're sitting on the Jacked up 2020 Platinum. Love that truck. And we also got the Cadillac Escalade for the missus. You know, she's got a ride in luxury too. We can't just be riding the Platinum and put her in a hoopty. I mean, we could, but it's not right. Got this acre and a half man-made pond right out in front of the house. Two picnic tables, a gazebo, beautifully landscaped, right around the front of the house, toy garage, and I say toy because that's what we've got in here, it's nothing but toys, nothing but toys. So there we have the private helicopter. Are you going, you got the money. You got enough money to pay thirty-four million dollars for a horse ranch. You gotta have a helicopter. Cause you're nobody. You're nobody if you don't have a helicopter. Inside we got the Skag Zero Turn lawnmower. It's kind of empty in here. We got the Rubicon Jeep. We got the Grizzly Creek Camper. Nice low rider 64 Impala. I love that car. I just I like it. It just I like it. It's just it's pretty. Got the new Corvette. That thing will fly. I mean fly. It says uh oh god. I think it says on the speedometer when I got it turned on. Yeah, that thing's a beast. Put that thing back where it was. Yeah, I mean that thing is just It's insane. It's insane. I cut that thing off for somebody gets killed. Got the Polaris Razor. Or, uh, it's not the Razor. Excuse me. That's the Ranger. I bought the Ranger for this place. And that just about does it right here. I hope you guys enjoyed. I'll give you guys an aerial shot. And we hope to see you again. If you, if you want to see any kind of build, anything, just drop a map drop a map map in a map in the comments and uh man I'll, I'll get it and i'll build it and uh i'll showcase it all right guys have a good one thank you